Hello and welcome back to Goat Farmer Bryce. I'm just kidding. I'm doing my aunt's chores while she's gone for a few days. So I'm spending a little time every morning and night going out doing chores for her. Johan. Okay, you may go. Huge thank you to my sister for the shop Keurig. We went and got this A-frame from my uncle's place. To take the loader mounts off. All it is is seven bolts here. There was a cross member here that we already took off. So there's one of these on each side. This side has all the hydraulics, but that's mounted to this bracket. And we gotta get the cables out of the cab and unhook these hydraulic lines back here. We're gonna put that loader on the 245 tractor, which is this one here. Those loader mounts should bolt right up to these. And I know what you're thinking, hey Bryce, how are you gonna do all your farming if one of your tractors is sold? Well, we have an announcement coming, let's just say that.
All right, sweet deal. We got it unbolted from the tractor. We'll set that down and work on the other side. Supper and midnight. <laughs> Did he? Still using it today. taken off that MX-255. Pieces are laying everywhere. Now we're bringing the 245 in here so we can put the loader stuff on it. I need to drill a hole through the floor of the tractor so the cables for the loader joystick can go outside. So I'm going to drill somewhere around here. But there's some pretty important wires down here. So I got to make sure I don't hit that one. But I'm going to attempt to drill right here. Wish me luck. I decided to go with a lot smaller of a hole because down underneath there was like a cross member under the floor that I thought I was going to hit. There we go, there's a hole through a $100,000 tractor. That's fun. The 
Let's see if I can remember how this all came apart on Friday. This is the mounting bracket for the loader joystick and I had to move this from the other tractor into the new tractor and I thought it would just bolt up but apparently the two seats are different so I had to drill these holes and drill a hole right here trying to get that to mount up when I'm done the joystick should sit somewhere around here. I guess that's going to bolt up fairly decent but I don't like the angle of this the joystick's going to be too close to your knees so I want to bend it over so it's kind of in line with this so now it's time to heat and bend <laughs> project is kind of winding down we got these mounts put on like they should be all bolted up good and the cab is about how it should be I got this joystick mounted and I got it bent like I wanted it so everything should be ready to go we haven't hooked it on the loader yet that'll be coming pretty soon here but I wanted to get this video out to you guys Thanks for watching this video everyone. Please consider subscribing. I want to make this channel as successful as I can. So if you go down below and hit subscribe, that would help me out a lot. And also like the video. Thanks.